Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a little different. Um, I decided to share an online haul. And what I mean by that is I like to experiment with different digital papers. And today, uh, um, let me see, let me pull it up. Sorry, this is design space, I was messing around. Poco Doodles has a sale going on with their digital kits. And I saw it actually posted on Instagram. And it all started because um, Tamika from Scrap the World posted one of her cards. And I was like, oh, that's really cute. So I wanted to check out the website. I've never been here before. And their website is um, pokadoodles.co.uk. They are from the UK. And right now they have a sale. Like I said, you can type in September 30 and gives you 30% off. And I went ahead and purchased this Winnie White Christmas Big Kahuna download kit. And it comes with a bunch of digital downloads. And I think I only spent like $18 on it, which to me is really good. Especially if you like to do card making or mini albums or what have you. It comes, actually let me sum it up real quick before I, uh, it comes with. Let me go down to the details. Just kidding, this is for when I downloaded it. Do, 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 do. Let me find it again. Oh, oh, it's typing. I'm sorry, I'm doing this with one hand. Let's see, I'm going to copy and paste this actually, since I am doing this one-handed. So I can tell you guys exactly what's in the kit. There it is. So it's already on sale for $26, originally it's $44. Like I said, this is a very good deal. This includes all of that alpha numbers, the 15 Winnie black and white digital stamps. So if you want to call your own, that's amazing. And 22 black and white digi stamps, which is like more of like uh, cats, owls, mice, presents, and that sort of thing. And then 48 printable designer papers, 10 design sheets, which I'll show you what all that is, sentiments, tags, frames, word art, embellishments, flowers, foliage, toppers. And I think you get a little extra. I could be wrong. And it tells you right here, please note this kit does not include a CD menu, images are in folders with easy access to open, both PC and Mac. So you get over 530 images with this, which to me is amazing. There's one other store that I've experimented with, and they're pretty good too. What were they called? Off the top of my head, I can't remember. Let me see if I've got it on my desktop. Why can't I think of what it's called? I don't even see it on my desktop. I like to hide stuff from myself, so... School events, I got like photos and stuff, everything's on here. This is my cooking digital, I bought that off at Etsy. Alright, well, maybe another time. Hopefully they didn't get deleted. Which is a good possibility, since I don't see them on here. Oh well, actually I know they're probably on here. So, let's get into it. So, here's the first... trying to preview it. So here's the papers and they are pretty accurate to color. Let's see if I can take this light off. I think they're really pretty. I like the stripes or plaid and stars, ornaments, no stripes. This was white obviously, a little bit white and blue. So there's those ones. Each 
you will hear my TV in the background. I stayed home today. I was not feeling good and had a trip um, for a migraine and all that fun stuff. So I decided to kind of distract myself and keep myself motivated around the house to get rid of this cold. That one's really pretty. <clears throat> it's a bunch of holly. I like the pattern. A bunch of candy canes. I did zoom up. I'll zoom back out. If you're like me, like I have to sit on top of things to see it, because it's pretty. Now uh, that one looks like it's a gradient, it's actually just the pink color, the top color. I like how those aren't exactly straight. That's really pretty. I think I, I'm repeating now. Okay. And last but not least, more plaid. Now what are some of the common questions on digital papers? So, when I print, I print 8.5 by 11, uh, normal standard printer, paper, cardstock from Walmart. And here's your alpha, sorry I'm all over the place. This is your alpha, you can upload it to the design space and it's already like an SVG so you don't have to do anything special with it. You just click the white background off. And it does print exactly how you want. Uh, HP has, it depends on what type of printer you have, but HP does have deals where you can do $5 a month and it's like, what is it? Um, what did I say? Okay, let me repeat this. So HP has um, their little bundles where you can do, or not bundles, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm going to say specials. Where for three dollars a month you can get what is it fifty sheets? You know what? Let's just look. I think I still have it saved on my desktop. Or not desktop, but it's called Insta Ink. HP Insta Ink. And I believe I pay three dollars a month and it's like you print fifty sheets. I just upgraded to four dollars a month or four ninety nine. So for five dollars you get a hundred sheets, three dollars you get fifty sheets, and I believe there's another one for I think ten dollars and you get like three hundred sheets. If you don't use them all, they roll over, so it's pretty cool. So right now I've got fourteen used out of a hundred, which I really haven't been using much. However, I probably will now because I'm trying to get Christmas stuff out. So back to what I originally was doing. These are your designer sheets. So you get all your ephemera, you get like a little designer sheet already. You can print all this out on your Cricut or Silhouette and cut it all. You can make like your bigger scrapbooking sheets by using the different ephemera and the toppers. This stuff is all sold individually, however, I really recommend the bundle because you're going to save money. And you will see this stuff over again um, when I go into the ephemera. This just gives you different ideas of the layouts using the ephemera and the tags and the frames and all that. So that is that. That is your designer sheets. Next to your digis, which these are where you can go in and color. Oh, that's cute. I love the little kitties. Huh. They have a holly as a bell. That's a pretty neat idea. So there's like a bunch of them. How many are there approximately? Uh, one, two, three, four. So 22. Probably 
what I read at the very beginning. I didn't even think that I already told you guys that. Oops. Now, embellies. As you can see, all those. I'll preview those. And you guys, my printer prints these out just the way you see them. Like, it shows you the shadowing. It shows you where the colors, like the gradient and the color. It's a big one. These are pretty big images. I mean, it takes me a minute to upload them in Design Space. Did I go through all these? I feel like I'm repeating. Oh, there's a gingerbread. Another gingerbread. So it kind of gives you the option. So if you're not a good colorer or don't really know how to color with like Copic markers and stuff, it's already done for you. If you do know how to color and you'd like to color your own, they give you that option too. Sorry I flipped through that kind of fast. There's just a lot of stuff in here. These are your embossing, embossing pages. So I really, to be quite frank with you, I don't really know what to do with them. Besides put them on vellum maybe as a background. Um, it's really pretty. I'm going to try a technique to use embossing powder on these. But other than that, my first thought was putting it on vellum, especially something like this. So there's your embossing. Foilage. There's a lot of these too. Sorry, my computer's giving you guys that computer screen. I wonder if it goes away if I turn this off. Yeah, it does. Not really. I turned the light off so you guys can see the color, however, in the computer. There it goes. Oh, do you guys see the jewel? Mm -hmm. Of course you can put your own jewel. You could layer that up. You could cut all that out. Put all that fancy stuff. I have repeated. Maybe not. The further I scoot back, the more you get those lines. So, alright, we're repeating now. Sentiments. I thought this was adorable. Is that not adorable for a background? Or maybe like in front of a card? Here's all your sentiments, well some of them, wishing you festive fun, joy, um, I can't read them for on my phone, let me go behind here. Joys of the season, festive greetings, Christmas joy, season's greetings, Noel, Merry Christmas, let it snow. These are your toppers. What you could do is obviously make a advent calendar. Oh, they even have happy birthday down there, so if you got a Christmas birthday, they hooked you up. And New Year's. Look at that, isn't that cool? I like how that shows up. Christmas is a race to see which gives out first, your money or your feet. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Let the spirit of love gently fill your fill our hearts and homes in this love, loveliest of seasons. May you find many reasons for happiness. And this is what I thought was really cool. Ongoing pattern of follow la 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 deck the halls. It looks like snow. And then it gets smaller ones.
These are the ones that I just recently did. So I put this one in front of, where's my little cutout buddy? There it is. I don't want to show you my whole desk because it's a mess. So at first I cut her, oh, I need the light. So at first I cut her out. Can you guys see that? Isn't that pretty? That's how it printed. And then my Cricut cut all that out. And then we were like kind of like flaking off on the side. So um, I got scared that it was cutting a little too much of my character. So I actually like it. So I might go ahead and do another one. But it's pre-colored. Here's the one I didn't cut out. So I kept that white background, which I'm going to have fun trying to go in and cut it myself now. But I used that with that, which now that I've seen one with the, the shopping, I might change it. Oh, look at that. Oh, go back. Isn't that pretty? I just love that old tattered look. Snow, Christmas. Oh. My phone's gonna die, it's on 20%. So I'm sorry, guys, I might have to flip through this pretty quick. Oh, it gives a smaller version of them. So bigger, 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 bigger. And then smaller. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Oh, that'd be cute on a card. Or not a card, a tag. Sorry, I know I'm flipping through them very fast, but there's just so much stuff. And we're back to the beginning, which we're probably back to the beginning a while yet. Nope, I just got there. Alright, so tags and frames. Here you have all your tags, like pre made tags. You got your frames. So it really looks like it's sparkling. Here's some more tags. It gives you your frames if you want some of your own frames. Oh, why do I keep closing out of that? And then your toppers, like I was telling you before. You put these on your cupcakes, which I might do if I can talk my cousin into doing a craft fair with me. She can bake something and I'll print toppers off for it. Alright, here is the black and white. And I'm going to take my time with these because these are so cute so that's this one but they're already colored that's a cute reindeer onesie shopping I think that's the one Tamika used or this one look no bird, wait, no bird, bird, no bird, bird. <laughs> Too much time on my hands. And I think we're back at the beginning for those. Yep. And then you get the ones that are colored. So there's my fave. It's got a background to it. I'm not very good at coloring right now, so I like the variety of them already being colored and then me going back and practicing. <laughs> Excuse me, that's cute. That's the one Tamika used. That's cute, I like that. It's cute too. All right, so we're back to beginning on those, and then these are just little word arts. So 
So like I said, you guys, you guys get a crap ton. That's the reason why I'm sharing this. I'm not affiliated. I'm not a design team member. None of that. I'm just a normal per person that likes to, you know, design. And I see all these video hauls of Michaels and Hobby Lobby. Very rarely do I ever see any digital ones. I will. I am in the process, as you can see, of making card. And I will get that posted sometime today. Um, if this cold doesn't take over. And once again, the website is... Um, minus, you see the ending? Minus that. So it's www.pokadoodles.co.uk And they have a 30% off code, which is September 30. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye.